What's up, everyone? Welcome back to my pickups. You're going to see some Japanese fashion sneakers and eyewear. Let's get to it. We'll start with the banger. These right here are garments from Issey Miyake. We've got the own police jacket as well as this Issey Miyake blazer. But we're going to start off with the own police. So one of the most popular pants right now are the own police by Issey Miyake trousers. But the jackets, they don't get as much love. And I get it. Pants are more wearable all year round, especially during the summertime. You're probably not going to be wearing this and it costs just as much, if not more than the pants. So trousers are just more bang for the buck. But yeah, this piece is beautiful. The pleated details are unmatched. It also has some nice metal hardware. I really appreciate that. And I did get this from a previous sponsor, so bless y'all for that. And because this specifically is from Japan, their sizing is more attuned to those that aren't as tall. So you don't even really have to tailor this. So yeah, this fits great on me, although I do have broader shoulders, so it's a little bit tight in that area, but it's manageable. As far as styling goes, of course, you can rock full on pleats, but I do think it's better to wear these with more simple trousers and let this be the statement piece. Even though it's a black garment, the pleated details make it standouts gives you nice texture and feels super premium this next piece from Issey Miyake is the 90s yeah I can't read that Google Translate says 90s archive Issey Miyake geometric quilted zip jacket that sounds about right when I first got this I didn't even know it was an archive piece so that's really cool so yeah this is just a fancy quilted blazer I love the details and the pattern on this piece the pop of color on the collar is a nice touch and is removable and instead of a front button it's just a simple zipper which does make this piece a lot more casual and that's probably how I'd style it so the next pickup is from fear of god in collaboration with adidas and i haven't even checked them out yet and that is why i'm partnering with poison the sponsor of today's video so poison is the leading online shopping hub that guarantees the authenticity of your products before it gets delivered to your door all you got to do is head to poison.com and utilize these codes i'm gonna leave it on the screen right here and you'll be able to get these sneakers at a discount as well as many other sneakers from nike or adidas these codes are limited so make sure you utilize the codes asap before they expire but let's do an unboxing shall we all right i'm gonna move you guys over here here. So first off, check out this packaging and ignore the blue tape. That's for privacy reasons. The cool thing about this packaging is it's anti-counterfeit. The color, the tape, the security tag, and this authentic certificate. You can also scan this QR code on here for additional information too. And I absolutely love that. It's very streamlined, very professional. So let's finally unbox it. All right, we got the sneakers right here. There we are. This collaboration with Fear of God and Adidas, very nice packaging. Oh, these are sick. Check that out. It also has that security tag right there. So you know they're authenticated. Man, these are clean. Yeah, these ones sold out before I was able to get them. So shout out to Poison for having a pair. You know, now that I'm checking it out, I might have to get the other colorway as well. But anyways, back to Poison. What's so cool about them is they have a solid competitive pricing compared to its competitors. All you gotta do is head over to their sites and check them out. They do have an app as well. So fellas, you know I got you. I showcased the codes earlier. Utilize these codes right here to get $30 off. All you gotta do is click that first link in the description once again utilize these codes right here to get a discount and thank you poison for sponsoring this video let's get back to it so yeah these fear of god sneakers come with a full rubber outsole it's thick it's right in your face and this whole sneaker is in a beautiful sandy suede colorway and the overall shape is chunky and pointy so that may or may not be for everyone but i personally like it and so that's why i prefer styling these with parachute pants and overall i do prefer the basketball sneaker but these are pretty sick what do y'all think these next two pieces right here are from the uk so my brits if you do pick up something from this brand it'll probably get to you pretty quick and that brand is called olive clothing y'all know i talk about this brand a lot it's my favorite brand for trousers and simple minimalistic timeless clothing so first off we got this rib jumper that sounds about right normally i would call this a jacket but since it's knitted jumper sounds about right although they do call this a cardigan and we got these tapered wide leg trousers let's start with the trousers so this is a size small and medium and it is a tad bit too long so at the moment to make it work i do have to cuff it but it will be tailored in the future i love the pleated details on this i would for sure wear this with a more crop jackets or I'd make sure to tuck in my underlayer because this is something you don't want to cover up. The pleated details add a more sophisticated vibe to your fit making you look a lot more mature. Obviously the goal isn't to look mature but if I were to go on a date I'd probably rock this over sweatpants and I would say it's decently wide. Definitely closer to straight fits than parachute obviously. Quality construction and a very versatile piece I would highly recommend. And then we have the rib jumper. This is in a lime colorway which has a more pastel touch to it. Spring is coming up and this will slide into your wardrobe perfectly. Obviously, they have black and this stone blue, but I already had the Isimiyaki piece as a textural black garment. So we went with this. I love the knitted texture. The color is perfect, not too bright or too vibrant, very subtle. And what I'm wearing is a size medium. You've got a drop shoulder, a slightly cropped look. And because the fabric does have a heavier weight to it, even though it's still a light jacket overall, 
it has a lot more flow. And that's what makes this piece and knitwear overall feel a lot more cozy. And one of my favorite aspects is the double zip, of course, always a nice touch and should be on every jacket. This is a really sick piece. Let's keep it moving. Next up, we've got some Nike pickups. We have these dunks right here, as well as this Jordan jacket. And so we'll start off with these dunks right here. These are regular dunks, but I skated in them anyways. I think it looks so good whenever I hit a sesh. The construction isn't the best, obviously, the dunks, but the colorway and the simplistic nature of the dunks in general will fit with a lot of people's styles. And then we have this Jordan jacket in the Stormtrooper colorway. It's white and black, and I think that's how you should style it too. Keep that same energy. And this one is sort of like a bomber or a track jacket. You've got that thick collar, but overall it's slim fits, nice Jordan branding, and very comfortable to wear. And surprisingly, this is slightly water resistant too. So for light rain, this is perfect. Up next, we've got our final pieces, both Japanese brands, a streetwear brand called Not So Ape, and an eyewear brand called Matsuda. So let's start off with this from Not So Ape. It's a simple, high quality, zipper hoodie that's basically it so yeah like i said quality is on point the hard barbed wire detail is a cool touch and it's just a nice casual piece that you can layer or wear by itself very casual now these glasses are from matsuda which is notoriously known for their premium glasses at a premium price which i didn't have to pay that much for fortunately because i went through the 260 sample sale stay up to date with that brand because they have a lot of sales for a lot of these premium brands and you can get pieces up to 70 percent off if not more now these ones are sort of like the sarah connor glasses is from Terminator 2. One of my favorite movies, by the way. So yeah, those are my pickups right there. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and until then, stay fly, check out Poison Deuces.